Okay, so instead of being fully in Dead by Daylight, we are in the world of Dead by Daylight. We are trying out the casting of Frank Stone. So, this is a demo on Steam. I thought I'd check it out before the full game comes out. And uh, we're going to see how this goes. they got a slight variation on the DVD theme, if you can hear it. Which is kind of cool. I don't know what resolution this is in. There's no real options in the game. Um, it seems to be cut off. So I'm actually going to have to stop this. Damn it. And fix this. Because that is not... That's not representative. The problem is, they haven't put it in an options menu. There's no options menu on the main menu. Um, which is not a good start. Okay.
Okay, that was a pain. Hopefully it's sorted now. Um, yeah, so I tried different ways of launching it. Yeah, so it's fine. I tried different ways of launching it because it kept launching in VR. I don't think this game's in VR, but it kept launching it in VR for some stupid reason. Um, but yeah, as, but yeah you, you could eventually get to the settings. Just have to go through a few things. Um, not very well designed, the UI, but there we go. So we're going to jump into Tile Lane. So yeah, you've got Die Together, even though on Steam page it says it's single player, this does have local co-op. Um, it's kind of like past the controller. Pretty much like all the Dark Pictures games. So we have those. Collection will just be... I don't know, it'll probably be all the like film film reels that you'll be collecting along the way. So we're going to go to Die Alone. Cutting room floor. Yeah, okay. Don't know why there's a thing there. I guess because if you don't pre-order, you got to wait for it to come out. Annoying. You lock those kind of things behind pre-order, but it's one of those things that they do. So we're going to do a new game. Yep, new save. Observer, your witness suffering, but survival was expected. You will not escape torment, but you may survive. Leave behind all hope of survival. Uh, we'll go for the basic one, I guess. Selena Ryo underscore one just followed. Hello, Serena. Selena, even. <laughs> I'm good, thank you. How are you? I've sacrificed everything searching for it. A world within a story whispered to me centuries ago. Of a timeless power, infinite in knowledge, voracious in hunger, the entity. A realm so close to ours, but always out of reach. Until I found him, Frank Stone, my key, my killer. I am Augustine Lieber, and I'm about to change our worlds forever. The casting of Frank Stein. I find that a very intriguing title. Like, why is it casting? Oh. Oh, are we from the perspective of a dog? That's it. That's a good boy. Yeah. So this must be Frank Stone then, because that's the mask we've seen in all the promos. Was that a baby? Missing infant. Okay, yeah. So we know where that missing infant is. Oh. Well. 
I guess the police are about to find out where it is too. The burning Moor. 1963. Cedar Steel Mill. This, this person isn't Frank Stone. <laughs> Are they in league with Frank Stone? Like, why is he? Why is. Oregon Police Department. So he's just like sleeping around while. While Frank Stone is doing his thing. I'm assuming you're the night watchman here. I am. Or just you? Covering the entire site? Oh no. I got help. Where are they now? On duty? Well, the manor. Merlin just goes where he pleases. Merlin? A dog. Doberman Pincher. Best friend a fellow could ask for. Loyal to the seventh horn sounds. Trust him more than I trust myself. Hmm. Well, does, this, does the mill really need that much security? But boys, you know, mentioning about Frank Stone, I guess. Do, he must know. I need to ask you a few questions. I'm yours to dispose of. Can I have your name? Thomas Jefferson Holt. Call me Tom. Officer Sam Green. Tom, I want to talk to you about. I know it about. That missing boy, right? That's right. You think he could be missing here? This mill looks a big place. Biggest in all Cedar Hills. That don't make no difference. Ain't no funny business going on around here. Not undermining Merlin's noses. Is he oblivious or lying? Mm, but there were records. You sound confident. And rightly so. Can I check your records? No records? The logbook, visitors to the mill, out of our shifts, that sort of thing. Well, right, right. Uh, <laughs> Doesn't have any of those things. <laughs> gotta be here someplace. He hasn't been recording anything. Is that it? Uh, you sure? <laughs> allow me. I see. Hmm. Someone's been faking the entries. Do do we know this? Been drinking. Yeah, I mean, does he smell of booze? We don't know this. Is anything suspicious? So we're we just accusing for the sake of it. I wish we could look at the book. But yeah, he shouldn't be drinking if he's on duty of being a guard. Is there anything like what's he guarding from people stealing stuff? I guess. Uh, yeah, let's question him. Have you noticed anything suspicious around the mill tonight? Tonight, last few nights, anything at all? Oh, nothing. 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 Hmm. Why, well, heck, if you don't believe me, ask your boss. My boss. Sheriff Kusich. Right. My boss. He saw by last night asking about the exact same thing. And I told him the same thing I'm telling you. There's no way that boy could be here. Well, can we take a look around? I don't know about it. And what did the sheriff say? Okay, Tom. And he got back in his car and left. Huh. So what you're telling me is nobody's actually checked the mail for any sign of the boy. When you say nobody, does that include Merlin? No, Tom. Yes, I do. <laughs> you can't get... Investigators <laughs> only. In that case, Sam, I find it hard to argue with your assessment. Like the dog's going around. What do you think? Is it Lassie? Any objections if I take a look around the place? No objections from me. 
course, everything's locked for the night. It's not a problem. There's Merlin, of course. Of course. Do you have control over the Next dog? Time I'm looking for him. Thank you for your help, Tom. Happy to oblige. Hmm. As I go back to your booze. Yeah, it's hard to tell whether he knows Frank's there or not. Should because he had lights on, so surely you'd see the lights, wouldn't you? Uh, it seems there are some just random lights on. So I guess he just drinks and doesn't patrol around. Oh, yeah, his security hut is quite far away. Well, well we just saw that there's uh, a light on over there. Uh, we can't climb over things? Okay. Actually, while we're here, let's have a look around. Wonder if there's like Easter eggs or anything. Oh. Okay, so there seems to be a way through there. That might be progress. Is, is that the old guy shouting? Or is that Frank shouting? Merlin! Oregon Flyer. Oh no, this isn't progress. Oh. Oh. It actually is. Just like always, like an alleyway, but no, you can squeeze through there. Somebody's taking the fence down. Thanks, security guard, for doing your duty and protecting everyone. Staff only. Maybe there's a window I can climb through. So there is. Okay, so there's two ways to go. Huh. Easy does it. I guess why is if we go through this window? Huh. What can we see in there? Well, where does the other way go then? Let's try the window. Although it looks like we can't come back. Can we? Well, we can. So this is the way that Merlin came. Storage shed 52. Oh, we can squeeze through this way now. So what are these things? We had metal plates? Oh yeah, I guess it is a store, uh, a steel mill, isn't it? <laughs> I 
in this area is I, I don't understand what those are what those numbers mean okay let's go in Best safety measure is mindful worker. You will not be able to return to this area. Oh, okay. Well, that's cool. It, it, um, it gives you a warning. Oh, what's this? Please personal record. February the fourth. Preferred name TFA. What? So unreadable, pretty much. Position machinist. In a house, I guess. See the hills. One charge of assault, robbery. Uh, sponsored early release. Okay. So there's nothing actually in the cabinet. We're just looking. We just knocked something over. Friday um, afternoon, two to ten. Harold Norris, Dennis McCann, Bobby Rivers, Frank Stone, Lou Osterman. Graveyard, ten to six. Move Dawkins and Stone off graveyard to pick up slack. No use running free crews with half the manpower. Some fellas gonna have to double up shifts. Told the lump the lumpkin out front no one's working nice for a while. Is this still in operation? Feels like it's in like disrepair, but Okay then look. Although we could go back, right? Should we go all the way back? And go the other way? Does that sound insane? It kind of does, right? So what is through here? Like I'm thinking maybe the, that the other way is progress and this is just a dead end. Took a while there for the flashlight to recover. Yeah, this is a dead end. Ah, but there is something here. Iridescent King. She promised to take away my pain, take away my nightmares. Is there any reason to inspect this? No? Doesn't give us anything else? Guess not. Got ourselves a chess piece. Is, is that what we're going to do? Is find ourselves a chess set along the way? There's something swinging around. Uh, what is that? 
Why is there like a giant line going all the way up? Am I supposed to be seeing that? Is that a problem with the skybox? Ooh, like why is there a giant line up there? Is that the entity? <laughs> hmm. Do we have a gun? Or an American police officer, so probably. Yeah, I can just see the handle. Oh, this way. Okay, let's see what's behind this door. Gotta move the pallet. Oh. Um, okay, that's where we came through. Molten metal? Molten metal has it present? Oh, okay. That's hardcore. The ha harshest flame, or oh, the harshest flame, yields the hardest steel. Howard Kinsley Tester. We could go straight in, or we can go around. I kind of want to look what's in here. Locked. Oh. Okay. That solves our mystery, I guess. Hello? Anyone here? It's police. Whoa. Okay, they need to fix those electrics. Anything down here? Nope. Okay, we're going into... what is this? Did it say? Oh, wagon shed. That's an awfully rusty door. Can they still use it? Who's there? Hmm. What is that noise? Oh, is that Merlin? Merlin Dean's wink? Oh, can we vault over less? We can. There's also a way up. I hear the doggo eating something. I hope it's not what I think it might be. Okay, so this is blocked. And this door? 
Also doesn't open. Okay. Yeah, I'm really hoping <laughs> what we're hearing is what you know, my horrible f brain thinks it might be. Like, what is the doggy in? Hey, uh, Mr. Green. Officer. Oh, yes, sir, of course. Uh, we haven't seen Merlin, have you? No. Yeah, sorry. Ugh. You all right there? Ugh. Yeah, it's just... Jesus, you don't smell that? <sighs> Sniffer's out of commission. <laughs> Got a little too up close and personal with a can of mustard gas back in the trenches. <laughs> ah. It can be a blessing in disguise. Ugh. Gotta find out where it's coming from. What's it smell like? Nothing good. Sounds like dead things. Uh, nothing down here, is there? We hear it really loudly. Merlin, there you are, boy. We wondered where you got to. Uh. Come here, boy. Dang name it. Sure to like it if you two made proper acquaintance. God damn it. Ugh. What is this? There's nothing to inspect? I, I guess not? Did you put this out for him? No. It looks like someone else has found his way to your boy's heart. Through his stomach. It ain't possible. Merlin and me, we're a team. Who'd want to come between a man and his best friend? What is it, though? What's that? Some kind of wiener mate? Uh, that's an ear. That's a human ear. So, no. Looks like an adult-sized ear, though, thankfully. Will you look at that? That damn dog? Dogs been eating people. Think that belongs to the boy you're looking for? It's too big, right? Yeah, it came from someone else. An adult. Nah. Came from someone much older. A teenager, maybe. Jesus, married a milkmaid. Hey, you know about any other folks going missing in Cedar Hills lately? Well, I don't know. Who would know a thing like that? Well, somebody does. I mean, you know, I knew the police officer. Shouldn't, shouldn't you know about people going missing? I was an entire bucket of people. Oh. Oh, well, that's weird. Why is our collection thing here? I okay, guess there's no all chess pieces. Got like a horsey, uh, something. Flag, maybe? Tree? Sword, hammer. Statue. A rat or something. Hmm. Was that sound? What was what sound?
I love the creaking metal. Like old metal just creaks anyway. <laughs> I don't think that's just parts. My brain just reads that's like <laughs> just reads farts. Farts above. Oh, they went into the sewers? But that's not where we found them. That's so, not where they started. What is this thing? The grape? Yeah, what is it for? <laughs> it's, uh, for the furnace, I think. You don't know for sure? Yeah, I work at the mill, not in the mill. Hmm. Find something to pry open the grate. Oh, okay, we're going down into the furnace, aren't we? Wait, can we talk to him? No. So we're gonna need like a crowbar or something. That's what I need. What? Well this pipe on this drum? Oh no, the crowbar down there. Oh we're climbing over are we? Well that's convenient, the barbed wires and all there. Otherwise, we'd be stuffed. Gotcha. There's one tiny crowbar. Okay, let's pry this open. Stand back. Oh, okay, quick time event. Take this. Use the radio in my car and call the station. Where, where are you going? You, you really think that boy's down there? I don't know. But I got a feeling, and it's not a good feeling. Can you wake up? Wait for backup before going down? I'm gonna need you to take this too. Make sure the sheriff gets this. Oh boy, I don't know. Monocle underscore Justin just followed. Thank you for the follow, Monica. How are you? Are you, are you excited for um the Castle of Frankstone? The full game? I need your help here. Uh, I have time for this. Yeah, we yeah, we need them to be supportive. We need to you know, help him out rather than get him riled up. I need your help here, Tom. I wouldn't ask if I didn't. I just don't know if I'm made of the stuff, buddy. They don't call it a higher calling for nothing. You gotta rise to meet it. You can do this. Tom's freaking out and he's not the one going down in the down into the furnace. Hey. I'm counting on you, Tom Hope. <sighs> They're probably gonna get fired because people are being <laughs> being murdered in the uh, steel mill under his watch.
Oh. Oh, I, I think we're, I think we're stuck down here now. Find a way to the furnished chamber. Ah. Uh, I was. Ah, oh, hat. Damn it. We're not gonna pick up our hat. We're just gonna leave it here. Oh, that would be docked. That'll be docked out of our wages. Wait, which way? Um. Uh, hmm. Well, towards the light would be the furnace. But what's the other way? Furnace access. Oh, it's in here. That's funny, I immediately look on the ground for um, a bear trap. <laughs> ah! What's going to be in this box? Oh, it's a horsey. I know what it is to believe. Through the forest above is clear and the fire waits for me. Nice. Oh, this goes down. Okay. Damn. It's a maze down here. So that actually feels like progress to go down, right? To go down into the furnace. So what was the other way? Well, that says furnace access is that way. So what's down then? This this isn't furnace access. Oh, this doesn't seem to be anything down here. Oh. Fake war? No. Playing too many souls like games. Like, oh, is that an illusory war? No. The sound design's great. I love the uh, the water on metal sounds. Oh, somebody's been burning like sconces. Who lit them? Hmm. Furnace access is that way. Someone is engaged in strange rituals in the hidden er hidden areas of the mill, because a sconce is lit. That equals a ritual. Not sure I agree with that, to be honest. And this door shut, okay. This is a bit of a maze, isn't it? Hmm. Another door. Can we open this one? No. Oops, getting stuck on terrain. Well, that's a very dead by daylight thing. This has got to be it. Yep. It's got to be. How's the smell getting worse? Oh. It's one of these things. I guess these must be real. But I've only ever seen these kind of lifts in Resident Evil. Oh no, it's not the same as their own tracks one goes the other way. Hmm. 
it's not just one massive platform. There's two things. But yeah, I haven't seen any of them in real life. Therefore, they don't, they don't exist. <gasps> okay, why can we intra interact with this? What is that? That's a rib cage. But we can't see it because the flashlight won't go uh, through the bars. In fact, it's going through our body. What? Okay, let's go further down. This place turns my stomach. Yeah. Oh. Do we have to crawl through that? Are we are we gonna have to crawl through that? Yeah, we can fall over. Oh, what's this? It's the hillbilly! The twisted man turned monster. Hello, Billy! Ah, oh, you're a cute Billy, aren't you? You've got like a razor blade chainsaw. Huh. A tiny little hammer. A daubs. Now if they don't put those in the merch store, they're missing out. Yeah, we got crawl through. Oh no. Goddamn small species. Mm-hmm. Yep. I'm the same. I I would never do that. That'd be me turning around. Although I wouldn't be going into a creepy basement in the first place. Ah. Is that the way? There's no signs anymore. That appears to be the way to go. Maybe? It's like, is this a dead end? Yeah, they didn't give you any room to go past these things. And they're all in the way of blocking the path. Did Frank set that up? Wait, what? To succeed a skill check, press space when the pointer is inside the success zone. Oh my god, we get a skill check! Ah! Oh! <laughs> yes! What happens if you get a great one? I love the little uh, mechanics being added in. Makes my nerd brain happy. Oh, what's this water down here for? Find his access that way. I guess this door's locked. Yep. Nothing behind the ladder. Oh, red room. The baby. Son of a fuck. Do you want to cook the baby? Dude, what are you doing? Run up there and so oh. Well, you haven't seen him, but why aren't you running up there to save the baby that's being like cooked right now? Rampled. What? Wait, where's the ladder? Um. Oh, I gotta use A and D for this. Where's the ladder, though? They talk about this one in the top left. 
It's going up. But that wouldn't help us, would it? I don't know where the ladder is. And because I don't know where the ladder is, I guess I'll go for ramp. Nice. <laughs> Frank with his weird helmet. His weird mask. Have we not seen Frank yet? Yes. Oh, he's right there. I mean, Sam, are you blind? That's aim and then target. Ah, oh, okay. Oh yes, knock his mask off. No, oh, she done a flashlight stun, Sam. I didn't see whether we got like skewered on something. We're gonna have to unhook ourselves. Oh. Oh, Sam. Come on, Sam. Get up. We gotta save that. We gotta save that kid. Yeah, pick up the gun and shoot him. Come on, Sam. Grab the gun. Yeah. We did it. Save the kid! Sam, get up! Oh, now he's being taken by the entity. And now he's joining the trials. Thank you for playing the casting of Frank Stone from the world of Dead by Daylight, a story of cosmic proportions. Delve into the mystery of Cedar Hills alongside a cast of characters bound together on a twisted single player journey where nothing is quite as it seems. Couch co op, the more the merrier. You don't have to die alone, get comfortable, pass the controller, and play offline with one to four friends. Bonus content unlock extra content when you buy the deluxe edition early unlock of the cutting room floor and unique in-game outfits plus exclusive rewards in dead by daylight well that was fun that was cool i i enjoyed that and i can't wait for the full game to come out it's gonna be super fun so i'll probably play the I'll probably play for the first time um just on the channel on the youtube channel uh you'll find the link below 
and then I'll probably play it multiple times after that streaming so I think the first time I won't stream and then the second time through I will so I'm going to end this stream now and then I'll, I'll be back in a few minutes and then we'll try out the Castlevania chapter for Dead by Daylight so thank you for all those who followed thank you all for those who watched and I'll be back soon